All right, I did a previous video in this series on uh, looking inside op amps to see what dyes are being used um, in fake op amps. Um, I did a previous one where a viewer graciously uh, took one of my LM358s, this is a real one, opened it up and found this die inside in instead, which is a C665, whatever that is, some random design that was done once in China, and it's used often in fakes. And so uh, uh, my my uh, LM358 actually turned out to be C665, so it ha ha had a much faster slew rate, which is nice for some, for some things. But people have been decapping op amps and talking about them for quite a while. There's a pretty long discussion thread on EEV blog. Um, there's some people who have been contributing. Uh, Zepido Bars has been doing lots of uh, dye decapping and, and beautiful photography. And I think there's a, a user on EEV blog, uh, Magic Eraser, I think is his moniker. Um, and he did a lot of stuff on fake op amps as well. Here's just a smattering of others things that people have uh, that have found. So um, this is a real uh, JRC five five three two that goes by other names as well, but it, the number stays the same five five three two. Very very common op amp and audio equipment and stuff. Uh, here is a fake part that was labeled five five three two. This is the E chip. I guess that's an E or three. I think it's number three. I think this is upside down. I think they call this the number three chip. All right. Cause it has that three down the center up upside down three. All right. Uh, another one they were looking at, this is a real, uh, JRC four, five, five, eight. And here is a clone, obviously very different than the original. Uh, this chip is labeled a four, six, three, three, four, another strange design. Um, other people have decapped LM 358s before. This is a real one. Uh, and this is a fake one. Uh, this one is not marked. This is another fake LM 358. I don't think this one has a marking on it either. And, um, this one happened to have the same chip that I had in it. It's a C665, so somebody else found that in one of theirs. Uh, this is one of my most popular chips that I use. It's a uh, LT072, uh, very odd looking die. It has very uh, fancy front end uh, FET uh, transistors. So those chevron and or X shaped things down there, those are the input uh, FETs into the, uh, into the part. And these are all do, uh, dual op amps. So the left-hand side and the right-hand side are mirror images of each other. Um, and then here is a fake 072, which has nothing to do with that other one. Yeah. They just randomly throw stuff in and just label it whatever they want. Uh, this is a very nice part. This is part I've, uh, learned to like a long time ago. What's the date on this one? 1986. This is an OP07. The OP07 was great for years and years and years. So that's a real one. And uh, here's one that somebody bought. Uh, and it has a 956 die in it. Yeah, whatever a 956 is. And then there's some other strange chips you'll sometimes find um, in random op amps. This is a uh, 659 chip. I think people find these uh, around quite a bit. This looks very much like a 350, 358. Um, it has some, looks like lateral PMPs down at the bottom there. And uh, yeah, that looks pretty much like a, uh, a rip off of a 538. And here's the same chip photographed by somebody else, the uh, 659. Anyway, just to point out that uh, if you get a fake op amp, it can be one of, I think they've identified upwards to 12 or 13 different uh, just odd Chinese designs that just get randomly thrown into op amps. 
Um, most of the times, if you buy a single op amp, um, they actually use a dual die op amp and just bond out one half of it. Um, like I, I had some fake 741s that just used a kind of a fake LM358 and just bonded out one side of it. They didn't even, it, it, those chips don't, didn't have a comp compensation in the die. So they just didn't bond those out. So the compensation pins on the 743 weren't bonded out at all. They were just floating. And you'll see things like that. But most of the single op amps are, 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 are faked with dual op amps of, of various ones. Anyway, it just gives you an idea of there are quite a few uh, floating out there. And if you want to go search around on the web, you'll find a lot more of these things. Thank you.